All right, guys, so it has been a while since a video, so uh, I got a couple products I've been meaning to get around to playing around with, so let's take a look at one. What we're going to be looking at today uh, is an 8.5 inch LCD writing tablet. Uh, these are a pretty cool thing. Uh, I've never heard of these before, but I started playing around with it, and my goodness, is this cool. So uh, basically, it's like an LCD board that senses when you touch it, like you can sense drawing on it, but you can also erase things from it. Um, like partially and you can also double click to wipe it clean uh, this is really cool in like education or like if a kid just needs something to play around with to draw on uh, these kind of remind me of there was these black film papers that you could scratch away and they had like a rainbow pattern behind them and you could make really cool designs that's pretty much what this is so um, basically it's by this company called Veyenson uh, it's pretty cool. I'm just gonna open it up. We're gonna take uh, play around with it uh, and we'll go from there. So uh, Let's crack this open and see exactly what we get. So first off like first impressions. This thing is incredibly light um, I don't even know how it's running off a battery. I would assume it's like a, a button battery or something small on that level So we got a nice little thank you card uh, some information about it. Thanks for purchasing this uh, You know leave a review things like that um, these look to be possibly, um, like, patterns that you can trace over, maybe? That's pretty cool. We'll play around with one of those in a bit. Alright, we have instruction manuals. Uh, not in English, but the instructions are pretty much on the back of here, so if you do need to take a look, you can pause the screen and read through it if you need. But, honestly, I'm just kind of interested in playing around with it right away. So, let's take out the pen. And let's write, hello. So you can see, like, it's got kind of like this rainbow pattern on it as you move across. Uh, but what's really cool about this is you double click the delete button. Oh, I think I, yep, I left it on lock. So that's my fault. Uh, there's a switch on the back. I did open this and play around with it before a little bit. But if you double click the delete button, it disappears like magic. Uh, and this other button we'll get into in a little bit. So, you know, I could write anything, you know, any randomly chosen word. Uh, and then let's say I did want to erase it. If I click this, you get that little blue blinking light. That means we're in erase mode. So what I can do is actually go in and slowly erase uh, some of these things. Now, the erase mechanism is not perfect, but my goodness, does it do a good job for such a, like, light and easy to use item. All right, so you know I could erase the E from here. Um, it does take a little bit of time to erase it, but it is pretty neat. So I could turn it from subscribe to subscribir, uh, asking you in Spanish, I hope to subscribe. All right, uh, but you know again we have that partial erase, and I can double click the delete button, and it wipes everything out completely. So, you know, whatever you end up drawing, it comes in pretty vividly, and then you can wipe it clean when you're done. The partially race also has this cool feature where if you press and hold it, see how it blinks like four times right there? Um, I would imagine that that increases the intensity of erasing it, all right? Uh, and if I press and hold it again, all right, well, I had one blink, so if I need to erase something, this does not do an intense erase. Uh, it just does like a very like minor erase. Press and hold it. We get two blinks, level two, three blinks, level three, and then we go back to level one. But if we have the erasing off and we press and hold it, we get four blinks. Uh, oh, no, just three blinks, sorry. It blinks itself on after showing. Uh, my mistake, but yeah. Uh, I like this. Let's try doing a quick little trace pattern, see what it looks like. Uh, it looks like there's a bit of a glare right now on it, so... Uh, let's do something rather easy, because I am not an artist. So we've got a mouse here. So we'll quickly trace it. This is where you get to make fun of my skills for tracing. And again, I'm moving pretty fast. Uh, you know. No judgment. This is a judgment-free channel. Unless I judge project products. And I just mixed up the paper, so that'll be fun. All right, and hey, not bad. Um, you know, looks like we got my thumb here. So again, this is when the erasing would come in where I can 
get rid of those little thumbprints and those little dots that I made. And uh, yeah, it's not bad actually. That's a pretty cool mouse. So um, I thought this was a really cool product. When they asked me to review it, I got like really excited because just, I don't know, uh, I kind of didn't believe it even existed. Oh, I should probably turn off erasing if I want to underline. Um, you know, I, I kind of looked at this and was like, that can't be a thing. Uh, but apparently these are pretty popular in education and other areas. So, uh, I kind of enjoyed it. It was pretty neat to play around with. Uh, just taking a peek at the back, you know, again, these are not made to be like ultra expensive. These more appear to be like, uh, a very nice thing that you can use for like, you know, a child to play around with, or if you want to do it for a classroom, I can even lock my drawing, uh, even though I was able to draw on it right there. Uh, I don't think I can erase it at this point, so, uh, yeah, still things to learn, but let's wipe that clean, and then, boom, it ceases to exist, all right? So, yeah, uh, these are pretty good. Like I said, they're, like, super thin. It weighs next to nothing. Like, this weighs less than, like, I don't even know. This weighs, like, yeah, I got a uh, can with, like, maybe, like, a half, a quarter inch of, like, still seltzer in it these weigh about the same so like this weighs next to nothing um it's pretty neat uh i like it i'm a fan of it i'll probably be keeping it around the house to play around with it a little bit and yeah so uh that's about it so hope you guys enjoyed watching this i will leave a link in the description if you want to purchase one or uh you know explore what they are and learn a little bit more about it but yeah that's about it so toss me some questions in the comments section i'll be more than happy to answer it and thanks for watching